thing is a sense of respect, right? You see Japanese brothers and sisters, they bow towards themselves yes. as a sign of greeting. That's fine. Would you, would yeah, you, uh, that's fine. That's that, fine. Would, okay, because hold on, I know you think it's fine, right? But would you say that's idolatry? No. Because they're so not, now because there's they're, a difference, right? Yeah, there is there's a difference. A, there's a distinctive feature. Okay, because, can you explain that distinctive okay, feature? Because they're not saying, that, okay, you're God, or if I touch you, I'm going to be forgiven forgiven of my sin. Right. That is error. That is erroneous. Uh, okay, so let me, so let me clarify that on the Muslim position, right? Yeah, go on. We're not saying now that if we kiss the stone, that the, if we kiss the stone, that we're gonna hold on, hold on, brother. We're not saying, we're not saying that if we kiss the stone, yes. that the stone itself no, is going to give no, us. No, you're, you're saying that if you kiss the stone, you're saying God, yeah. God will. And I'm telling you, that's a lie. Okay, because there's something you don't believe. Not, no, it's not no, something it's I don't okay. believe. Right. Okay. That's, not, that's not the teaching of the real God. By it's God. not the teaching. Okay, it's but, not, that, but you're saying though, that from a, a as a Christian, you're saying that. Correct? I'm not saying. I'm not saying. I'm not saying I'm objectively, that's not the teaching. That's not the teaching. Okay, which teaching? You're going to let me finish. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No, I apologize. Go okay, ahead. good. So, the real God in the Old Testament, right? Okay. So as you say it as a Christian. Okay. Even objectively, even if I was agnostic and I'm reading this, reading the the Old Testament. Yes. You're bowing down to anyone. I can read the Ten Commandments as an agnostic. Yes, but you have Let me, you're still yeah. interrupting. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Sorry, I apologize. I could read the Ten Commandments as, a, as an agnostic. Yes, you're right, you're right. You're right. I know that. Yeah. So, and I could see objectively that people bowing down to, to this stone, touching this stone, right. how that's paganism. You were told that this came from heaven. Who told you it came from heaven? In the Quran. In the Quran. And where does the Quran come from? It's the words of God. So who told you that? Down who told by you somebody to, who was divine? Yeah, but who told you the Quran is the word of God? Who told me that the Quran is the word of God? Who told you? As Muslims, we yeah. believe that the, the, the divine word of God comes from God because we believe that this these words were divinely inspired because they make sense. There's evidences towards it, and then we, we and that and the belief is a subjective thing, right? You don't have to be a Muslim. People become Muslim voluntarily, right? Obviously, you know, if you're born into a Muslim family, that's a different thing, right? Obviously, your parents choose something for you. Right, but us as, as as Muslims, right? We believe that this is from the divine word of God because we believe that there are certain uh, divine things. For example, we believe that Prophet Muhammad speaks of things, right, when he's reciting the words of God that he would have known himself. So to answer your question like that, we have certain evidences, and there's whole books on it, right? People talk about. Okay, so to answer my ahead, question, let me, let me, to, my, to, my, to my to answer my question, yes, sir. The whole source of your religion is from one man. Yes, sir. Well, not well. There's prophets, right? There's prophets and messengers, right? But the actual text of the Quran. Quran comes yeah, from one Quran man. Itself, yes, sir. Yes, sir. He is his own witness. Yes, he claims to no, he, he claims to have met the angel Gabriel no, in a cave. Know. Yes. He's his own, he just claims it. Yes, sir. There's no witnesses to that. No witnesses. He's, yes. he's his own witness. Yes, sir. So everything from from is Islam comes from Muhammad. We're not in a disagreement. So he's he's his own witness. Yeah, we're not in disagreement. You choose to believe him. Yes, sir. If he tells you that stone came from heaven, you choose to believe yes, him. Yes, sir. So you say that this man is a is the what the greatest example for humankind? <laughs> yes, sir. He said himself, he's the greatest of it. He's actually the, said, yeah. the greatest example. Uh, so when you look at the life of Muhammad, yes, sir. does that demonstrate the greatest? human being that ever lived? I would say so, yes. Okay, so let's look at Muhammad's wives. Okay. Let's look at his marriage to Aisha. Yes, sir. Classic example. Classic yeah, example, yeah, yeah. yes. A bit tired, but okay, go ahead. Dude, it never dies. Yeah, okay. It never runs out. Okay, it's ahead. the gift that keeps on giving. Got you, got you. Okay. Because you know where I'm going with this. Absolutely. Wonderful. So I'm glad that you're prepared. So you're saying that a man who is in his 50s right. can marry a six-year-old girl, can then have intercourse right. with a nine-year-old girl and say, this represents God. During which time did this occur? Did this happen like 10 years ago, 100 years ago, it happened when 500 was years alive. ago? It happened when can you approximate, do you know approximately when he was on the earth? He was what, in the seventh century? In the seventh century, right, exactly. Okay, so you should know that, all so right? I'm, so okay. I'm asking you, I'm not, it doesn't preclude that I don't know what I'm talking about if I ask you a question. Back to my right? question. Right. Does that represent God, a man in his 50s, right. having intercourse with a nine-year-old girl? This Does represents the customs, right? No, 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 not the Hold customs. On, no, 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 hold on. No. You, you I'm not for me to let me finish, the right? I, just want to, I just want you to respect the same okay, way. Go on. Okay, go Okay. So that represents the times and the customs of the people at that time. Okay.
for example, right? So we're talking in 2024 in Hyde Park in Speaker's Corner, right? Would you agree? And this is a fact. Oh, no, no, no. You haven't answered my question. Okay. You said, you said, does it represent God? In, can you expound upon that? No, okay. it's a man and he, in his 50s it's having, having hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, a man in his 50s right. having intercourse with a child. Right. Does that represent, is that representative of God? His marriage to Aisha, because it was made through marriage, right? Because you're just simply classifying it as something that's, oh, um, like just something, it's just a pick year old, he sees a nine year old and he has sex with him, right? Said that. Plus you don't know, because you, you're just simply, when you phrase something a certain way, right? You know that it connotates a certain meaning to the people sounding without context. I'm just context, stating the facts, right? I'm, I'm stating what your religion says. Right, right, right. Your religion says that he had intercourse with her when she was nine. Right, right. And I'm just asking, does that represent... Where does it say that he had intercourse with her at nine? Where does you know it say that? that? You know where. Oh, if, I, if I know that, then you can know that, right? No, no, I'm no. Just a human no, no, being no, like no, you. No, where no. does it say that? No, no, no. Where does it say now that? Now you're sir? being disingenuous. Where does it say... No, I'm not. I'm you're the one you representing Islam. I'm asking you a very simple question. You're the one representing asking, Islam. So what? I can still ask a question if I'm representing Islam, can't I? Is it true? There are things that is come it true? in and is it true that he, other, right? Is it true that he had intercourse with a nine-year-old? I don't know that at the exact same... at the exact age of nine, I wasn't in his bedroom, so I don't, don't know exactly what happened. Of course, if, you, if, you're, if you're going to claim something, if you're going to claim something, you should have evidence behind it. Does your religion you say? Have evidence behind does your religion say? You I'm asking you, do, does your religion say that? It seems as though we're not going to have a constructive argument. You know, I'm right? being constructive. It's okay. So I want you have a good the answer is Bukhari. You, you should know that oh, yeah, the Hadith yeah. say. Well, now you have a reference. I no no, I had the reference, oh, yeah. but you didn't have the reference. Okay, but it's you okay. wanted to negate, and now you want to run away. If you kiss the black stone, your sins will be forgiven. That is a lie. Without the shedding of blood, there's no forgiveness. The black stone cannot save you. The moon cannot save you. Only Jesus can save you. Only Jesus can save you. Set you free. Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes unto the Father but by me. He's the only way to God. And Jesus said, There are two roads in life. There's a broad road and a narrow road. The broad road leads to death. But the narrow road leads to life. Many are on the broad road. Only a few are on the narrow road. Your religion will take you to hell. The false God is lying to you. Your false God is lying to you. Jesus said, I am the way. The only way to God. Thank God for Jesus. There's no other name under heaven. Give us a man by which we must be saved. The only way is Jesus. Palestine. Long live. Palestine. Long live. Palestine cannot save you. No. Palestine cannot save you. No. Only Jesus can save you. Yes. How you dying? Jesus defeated death. Yes. Hey. Muhammad is dead and in the grave. Well, you said God is the dying. Muhammad is dead and in the grave. Jesus died. And he said he laid down his life. So God died. He said, I lay down my life. God died. No one takes it from me. I lay it down because I have power to take it up again. Only Jesus has a power over death and the grave. No, you don't. Your Jesus is a false Jesus. The real Jesus is the Son of God. God. The real Jesus is God in the flesh. How Jesus God in the flesh? The real Jesus is God in the flesh. 
shut your mouth, you shaitan woman. Allah is shaitan. No Jesus, no salvation. There is only one name under heaven. Amen. Given to men. By which we must be saved. He has a good brain. And that is the name of Jesus. Muhammad is dead, but Jesus is alive. Jesus is alive. Why are you following a dead man? Jesus is alive. Even the Quran says that Jesus is alive. Even the Quran says Jesus is alive. But Muhammad is dead. If you follow Muhammad, you will end up in the grave. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Only Jesus can save us. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Shut your mouth. Thank God for Jesus. Salvation in Christ. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Thank God for Jesus. Jesus, 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 Jesus,